Welcome back. Newly elected Nelson Mandela Bay Mayor Ngaba Banga is accusing former ANC councillor Andile Lungisa of being behind the drama that took place in the council last night. Banga says Lungisa's release from prison was always going to spell trouble. Let me put it to South Africans. The first thing that happened there, and we knew that when Andile Lungisa was, re was released, there was going to be violence in the city. The two bodyguards who were removing the speaker there are attached to uh, Andile Lungisa and his bodyguards. He was outside with a video of him and photos of him. He's breaking his parole uh, conditions. He made that chaos. It was organized. And the speaker herself was part of that because one of those bodyguards was also her bodyguard. I've warned them that this was going to happen because I could see it being planned. They started to put tear gas, they started to put substances in the council to trust, destabilize uh, the meeting. It was confirmed by the lawyer of the municipality. The video is visible. We can see those people. A case is going to be opened to their meeting, the city manager at 10, because we can't, in a democracy, have a bodyguard of the speaker purporting to kidnap the speaker. All right, let's get a response now from Lungisa himself. Thank you very much, sir, for joining us here on ENCA. Now, you heard that drama seems to be following you. What's your response? Oh, thank you very much. I think uh, Nababanga, as a puppet of the TA, uh, I'll also be wasting my time uh, by responding to what is called a uh, black uh, mascot. Uh, we have no other responsibility in this country than to serve the interests of the former oppressors. Really, I'm not a Holy Spirit. I cannot be all over. The meeting, it was a meeting of councillors, uh, of council, which I'm not a councillor, which I was not part of that meeting, uh, which I had no interest in that meeting. I watched the proceeding like, like all and like an ordinary citizen uh, in Nelson Mandela Mato. He knows he's not a mayor as he's sitting there. Uh, Nelson Mandela City is not a Zaire where we can have the likes of Mumuto and Siseko uh, declaring themselves as mayors. He's not a mayor. He knows in the processes of meetings. As I was watching at the distance, uh, as I'm reading, I was reading on a number of uh, social media. He knows he's not a man. Uh, I'm simply saying if he needs to be a man, I think he must follow proper processes. He must not bring uh, my name on his jamboree. Uh, he must dance alone. Uh, I'm, I think I'm more fascinated uh, to him. Uh, he quotes more, myself more than he quotes even Chekovara, but he cannot go to Chekovara because he does not have that authority. He have long lost that authority. So are you, uh, denying, just, are you denying, Mr. Lungisa, that the two men who removed the speaker, um, as, Banga, as uh, Mr. Banga was saying, are you, are, you, are you saying that those two men are not your security guards and that no. you were not outside? No, it's just uh, a peckling innuendo. Uh, I was there. Uh, they took pictures of myself as early as 10 o'clock uh, in the morning. Uh, I was standing there early. Uh, the whole day, they took my pictures. Naba came and greeted me. Uh, we spoke. Rhino Kaiser came and greeted me. Uh, we spoke. They even took a picture of myself when I was talking to Rhino Kaiser. So why were uh, you what, there? Why were you uh, there, Mr. Ngusa? Why Hello? were you there? You said earlier that you're not there. a councillor anymore, and that was a Did council meeting. So why were you there? No, no, no. I go to I go there every day. They know I stay under that tree every day for the past 20 years. I invented that area. They came yesterday in that area. That is my place. It's where I stay every day. We can ask even a young person uh, who is a student who's studying at Nelson Mandela University. Even when they take uh, their transport going to school, Andy Lulunisa is there. Okay, but, but you're not explaining you to us ask why the ordinary you... citizen in Nelson Mandela America, where does Andy Lulungisa stay and stand? They will tell you it's under the tree between Plainies and City Hall. Everyone knows that. Mm. Even Naba himself, when he was a youngster, he used to meet me under that tree. Even when we took him to Johannesburg, a brutal house, 
Uh, Is there any particular to... reason why, Mr. Uh, Ngaba, uh, um, Mr. Lungisa, why you'd be under that tree even now when you're not a councillor anymore? And also those two men that they were saying uh, removed the speaker, I just want to ask you again, are you saying that they are not your security yeah, personnel? There were two, there were two pro protests outside. There was a protest of plumbers. Uh, we're fighting for the insourcing. Uh, I was told to over their matter. Uh, in the last council meeting was never entertained. There was also a protest uh, yesterday uh, of artists who wanted to be recognized by the municipality, who wanted to be affirmed. There was also a protest uh, of the security uh, members uh, who have not been paid for the past two years, uh, three years. Uh, I cannot be responsible. Whilst you know I came in jail for the last three months, I cannot be responsible for artists who are complaining. Mr. Lungisa, you're not answering my questions. Let me repeat my question for you, sir. Uh, for it was two questions. Yes, I just yes. want to repeat my questions because you're not answering my questions. One was, those two men who removed the speaker in the council meeting, were they your security guards? One. Two, no. you haven't really no. answered why you still stay under that tree that you're saying you always stay under. No. No, what I'm telling you, a proper, a better person who should be able to answer is Naba Bank, uh, the one who has been a council when I was in jail. He knows better, uh, was my bodyguard, was not uh, my bodyguard. Is that better person who's better positioned because he came and made all those uh, uh, new end uh, to yourselves. Is a better person who must be able to provide because those are the old. Uh, MK guys, those are the old Amabuto guys who are always there at City Hall every day who have been voluntarily uh, their own services uh, without being paid. Nababanga knows that even under their own administration probably those guys were there. He's just trying because he wants to stage a coup of some sort. He's trying to make innuendo and make lies uh, because he will be recognized better uh, in this country if he raises the name uh, of Andy the Lundisa. Anyone who raises my name becomes more fashionable. Even the newspapers and the media, they come. Uh, I think I'm more of a uh, Holy Spirit now. So what are your, if you take us in, into your confidence, Mr. Lungisa, what are your parole conditions? Because now uh, Mr. Banga is saying that you are violating your... No, you must go. I don't have a responsibility of explaining my parole conditions. Uh, to Naba Bank. Uh, the last time I knew is the one who deployed the three people to attack me. Uh, he must go and ask uh, the parole conditions to the authorities who are responsible for those uh, parole conditions. I know where I must go. I know where I must not go. I know my, uh, my parole conditions. If God is not, he's got the issue because he's got his own parole conditions uh, in his own uh, mind. Uh, he must go and hang himself or he must go to the uh, authorities and go and ask uh, parole conditions. I have no responsibility of explaining my conditions to Naba Bang. I don't account it to him. I will never account it to him. Uh, I have no relationship uh, with the DA. I will never have a relationship uh, with the uh, former oppressors. Mm -hmm. But now, um, Mr. Banga, Mr. Uh, Lungisa, excuse me, um, are you supposed to be anywhere near the council? Because you, I, are, you, you, you can, were sentenced I, my, for, my, um, my, you know, for assaulting my, with intent to cause grievous my, bodily harm my, against a, a councillor. Now I'll answer you. I can go in the council as a former councillor. I can stay uh, in the chambers. I can be outside. I can be on top of the roof uh, of that building. I can be anywhere. I can be anywhere, anywhere. Yes. But what, what do you say anywhere. then, Mr. Lungisa, about the kind of drama that took place at council, violence of, for instance, a, the speaker being, as uh, the new mayor was saying, the speaker being kidnapped? What do you say to that, to the kind of violence that took place at that meeting? No, no, no I'm saying I was not in a meeting. I saw pictures of what happened in the meeting, like yourself, like any other person. No? It is a responsibility of the speaker uh, presided over the meeting uh, to mm -hmm. conduct the investigation. 
was it was not my meeting, it was a meeting of the speaker. The speaker must undertake a process uh, to investigate of what happened uh, in the council meeting. I will then await uh, for that investigation. All right. Well, I, I guess uh, my last question to you would be, uh, did you learn your lesson from this sentence that you got? I mean, saying that uh, the, the new mayor can go hang himself. That's, that's very violent, especially looking at no. what you've been found guilty of. No, I'm saying he can go and hang himself if he's going to come and, and formulate lies. I was never arrested for lies. He can go and hang but himself. But for violence, you were arrested for violence. No, no, no. I'm, I'm saying hanging himself if right. he's going to go and formulate lies. All right. against my name. He can All right. go and hang himself. That's what I'm saying. All right. Thank I you very much. And his friends. Thank you very much. That is uh, former ANC councillor Andile Lungisa uh, speaking to us there about the allegations that he caused the drama in the council yesterday in Nelson Mandela Bay.